Namaste everyone. Did you try create observable.error which emit only error to its observers? And if you haven't, then please go ahead and watch our previous video episode. Links will be in the card and the description of this video. So in today's episode, we are going to create observables using empty and never. I know the method seems may sound a bit strange. So let me take you directly to the documentation. So as per the Rx Java doc, empty does not emit any item and immediately invokes on complete. Um, trust me guys, this method is really useful if you don't want to return null. It's a Rx Java way of returning null, so you can gracefully handle anything in the on complete. We are going to show you the practical implementation of all these factory methods later on this video series, but now let me give you a very simple example. Suppose you are finding a particular element on your database. Suppose a user have searched for something and you did not find anything in your database. So instead of returning null and handle it, you are going to return observable.empty. So before we create observable using empty, let's quickly check the documentation for observable.never. So as per the documentation, it never sends any item or notification to its observers. And notice one thing guys, it's specified here that this observable source is useful primary for testing purposes. So let's not waste more time and code empty and never. So let's create an observable using observable.empty and add an observer like we always do and don't forget to add the on complete part as it does not emit anything and just complete immediately Say completed here. Okay, now let's run. And there we go. You can see that it prints only completed on the screen. As it does not emit any item, so it skips the on next part. So it works as it should. So now let's create never. Let's copy everything and paste here. Just replace the empty with never here. And let's pause the thread for say 3 seconds. Just for the hope that it starts the emission at some point in future. And let's run. And the program is finished. So nothing has been printed on the console. So observable.never neither emit anything nor complete. So their observers keeps waiting for the emission. So that was our empty and never. If you have any doubt regarding today's video episode, then you can comment below or message me on any of my social handles. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe and bell icon so you don't miss our videos that we upload every Sunday. It's me too here signing off. Thank you for stopping by. See you next Sunday.